All right, we get ready for the second order, quarter of play at the Riverton Knights 12. The Olympic Trojans 9. And again, first quarter of play. Sam Tucker. I mean, a good first quarter as well for the Bremerton Knights. Three points, Sam, Sam Tucker in the first half. Tucker, five. Five points in the first quarter of play. And uh, I got mentioned they had 30 the other day. The Bremerton Knights have lost nine of their last 11 ball games. I believe when first uh, two of those, and both of those have come against the North Mason Bulldogs. And but if they can see the Trojans lose out, Bremerton Knights. They have two more winnable games against Kingston at home. And of course here against the Trojans, Malachi Kudu. Serve up a long triple and hits a shot. Ties the game up at 12. With 7.34 to go. Here in the second quarter play, just getting in the way here. Bomer to Tucker. Back to Bomer, tries baseline right, feeds one into Christian. Kicks it out to Pete, stakes left, down to his eyes, one flies, one his front, front rim no good. Christian Blewett goes up, gets the rebound, but is jabbed out a play by Oliver Christian from behind Olympic Trojans basketball. And so the Bremerton Knights have find themselves in a must-win situation here. And uh, well, no, he's a steal by the Knights. He'll be back the other way. Eight footer from Tucker. He'll get that one to drop through. 14-12, Knights on top. The 49th, they really got to take care of business here tonight at home. Trojans beat them the first time. Squirman beat Bremerton the first time. We have one more game left. They have more and more games. They split the season series with Squim. Now on uh, against Clegg. That's his second personal foul on Sean Clegg. 14 foul on the. Night on the not in play, excuse me, he was in Trenton Bowman. 14 foul on the Knights. Here's Clegg, off to the angle. Eye to three, shoots to three, off the mark. Going up high is Costco to get the rebound, the ball jabbed away. Here come the Knights on the run. This is the Bomber. he goes in, tripped, no foul called, just controlling the basketball. Here comes the Trojans, Quidini, baseline left. He tries a pass, that was mugged right back in his face. Here's Bomer on the run. To Tucker for five and hits. Tonight's going on a little bit of run. Now it's 16 to 12. That's up gun on a nice little run, a quick 4 0 run to start things off. Here in the second quarter of play. Timeout will take a 30 second break of this new high school basketball on the Mega Talk Sports Game of the Week. And we're back here at Left Seat Third Gym in Kenmo's Court, 16-12, Knights on top. They go in a quick little four, a little mini run here to start the second quarter of play. And the, the Liberty Trojans. For the Trojans, as I mentioned, they've beaten the Knights 22 out of 41 times. And have a one game winning streak against the Bremerton Knights. Bremerton's last win came back in February 5th, 2022. Christian Blewett with the basketball near side. Deion Stellars is coming to the lineup. Pass underneath, goes off the head of Oliver Christian. Turning you know, bounce out of bounds. Shows his basketball. Keith Whitener will come back in for the... Uh, Keith Whitener will come in for the, the Trojans. Just Crystal Blue with inbounds off to our left. Gets it in. The Whitener on the baseline, drives baseline, goes up with the little floater too strong. Tucker will yank down the rebound. Here come the Knights. From our left to our right, spinning in the lane is, is Tucker. Hands off to Sellers. He'll drive in. Cut off there by our defense. The Whitener. Now to Sellers. Pete will come off the screen and set up the offense between the circles straight away. 12 on the shot clock for the Bremerton Knights. Now 10. Near side to Tucker, he just can't handle the pass, goes into the Trojans bench, and out of bounds. Trojans basketball, Whitener will inbound for the Trojans. And Malachi Quinini. Well, he was a freshman when I was uh, doing the public address for the Trojans for a pair of years. 
filled in three years ago for a few games. They helped out Nate Andrews. He's right or right with the basketball and hands out straight away to Blue To the far side to right in the baseline. Trying to post up down underneath the white or can't do so. Gets it back on top to Blue Now a quick flip from Brini. Too strong. Off glass to the hands of Pete's. Did not draw iron there. Pete's going coast to coast. Throws up rim check. And the ball ends in the hands of Tucker. Goes up from 12 feet and hits. So an 18-12 lead now by the Bremerton Knights over to Olympic Trojans. Here's Dallin Anderson coming in for the Bremerton Knights. And Pete's will hobble off. Each week that ankle uh, at Central Kitsap last night. They may have uh, did it again here tonight a little bit. The boy, Knight can ill afford to lose. Beats is one of the great defenders on this team. And they look for him to bring the, the ball and handle the ball a lot. Here's Whitener from 12 off the mark. Allenson with rebound. Beats the Tucker coming out of backcourt. Speeds in the front court. David Clegg has stepped in for a long rainbow creep from the off angle on the back arm, no good. Then again, in the hands of Dante Acasio. Kristen Blue almost walks with it. He comes back down the other way. Is it the Whitener? Now to Acasio, far baseline. Trying to post up underneath to Acasio. Flips it out for a long three by Whitener. Just barely grazes the rim. Here comes a nice switch. Deion Stellar's going up. Dan converts the lay in. Goes off back iron, saving from going out of bounds for Acasio. Here's Cronini. Runs over. Sellers. And the Trojans score coming back the other way. 18-14, and the Bruins tonight turn the basketball over on the far baseline. Homer will come in. Sellers will go out. Maya Davis trying to calm him down a little bit. Knights uh, really have lost their way at times this season. Here's Houdini stepping back. Cut off by the defense of the Bremerton Knights. They get the ball on the baseline. Just Houdini, you'll fire one. Back iron, no good. Bowman will leap up and yank down the rebound for the Knights. Knights on the run. In their front court. Tucker spins in the lane. Up fakes. Back out to Bomer. Cut up there by the defense. Long pass out in front to Clegg. Back to Tucker, far angle. Now to Bomer on the baseline, drives in. Throws it in, throws one in. So Bomer hits, 20 to 14 now. Knights with their biggest lead of the night. At six, 20 to 14. Here's Clay. Knights get the defense to Bomer. Good defense by Bomer. Christian will drive in, kick out. The right. That's his own defense. Here's Brudini driving in. Finds a hole, goes in, hangs it here, flips it up and scores. Nice play by Malachi Brudini. Goes in, hangs in the air, goes to the up and the under, up the window, and hits it. He is fouled and will find himself at the free throw line. Ending the streak by the Bremerton Knights. They, they creep back to the four, 20 to 16, with 2.30 to go here in the second quarter of play. Crudini, the bend, flex, and free throw go in and out. Re off the rebound, pulled down by Luke Silva. And a loose ball foul called in the Knights on Bomer. That's going to be his second personal foul on Bomer. And we have two and a half minutes to go here in the second quarter. Down, gets it underneath the Whitener. He goes up and no foul. Loose control of the basketball goes out of bounds. Driven tonight's basketball leading by four, 20 to 16 with 224 to go here in the quarter. We will bring the ball out of back court. Slow dribble. Get down to Tucker. Now to Cadengo. Goes in up from 13 feet. And gets it to drop. Isaiah Kadingo sends the ninth lead now, 22 to 16. He being their largest lead of the of the night. Here, Leslie Thorn Jim. Blew it. 
far side. Ball jabbed away in the back court. He'll retrieve it. Hands off to Clegg. Clegg still with it as the ball in his pass to Whitener. Deflected. Whitener will go in and the ball stripped away from him. There's Whitener. Pass down to Tucker. To hold up the offense. Now flip to Kadingo for a long three. Too strong. Lands in the hands of Luke Silva. Rebound by Silva. Greeny will slowly dribble the ball out of backcourt. Hands off to Whitener. Out on top to Silva. Back to Clegg for three. No good, but there's 